Hey guys, and thank you so much for tuning in to my channel. My name is The Lady Designer, and today we are back with our little zoo tour marathon where we will be uploading a zoo tour every day until the end of this week to celebrate the launch of the Planet Zoo Console Edition. If you enjoy these type of videos and find them inspiring, then please do make sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel to not miss out on all these incredible zoo tours we are doing this week on the channel. And in today's video, we are going to check out this jungle Empire Zoo made by the awesome Migaela. Thank you so much, Migaela, for sharing your zoo to us for showcase on the channel. Really look forward to seeing another one of your amazing creations as you are always so inspiring. And if you want to explore this zoo yourself on PC, then definitely make sure to download and rate the zoo with the link in the description of this video. And if you have a finished zoo on either PC or on Xbox that you would like to see me check out on the channel as well, then please do make sure to read the description of this video of how you can send me your finish zoo and who knows i might be able to check out your finish zoo as well on the channel in the future now without further talking let's jump right into jungle empire zoo made by Mikaela. So let's start right over here at the entrance. Now, this is not a super big zoo, but Miguela always has a really great eye for design. So I'm very much looking forward to check this one out. We have a nice little parking lot and a beautiful road right over here. And then we enter here at the entrance. Look at these billboards even. Oh man, it looks so cool. You even have a QR code. That's insane. So we have a nice plaza here. Just look at the design here of the entrance. That is so cool. Oh, I love what you did with the beams here. And we have a ticket shop or ticket booth. Look at these billboards here as well. <laughs> what is here in the back? I guess that's staff. Just look at the doors. What? Oh my gosh, okay, I want to see. Okay, this is this is like a doorway going to a backstage area. Oh my goodness, this looks so good. There are lockers here. Is that for the staff? I guess so. I mean, it's the staff area, so I guess so. Okay, which door did we pick? I think it, I think it was this one. Okay, let's go here. Just look at the entrance right over here. Or the exit is probably. This is so freaking good. Okay, let's see. We're going to the right side this time. Just because we can. We have toilets. Oh my gosh. It's Whoa, this is so nice. Look at this. We even have real toilets. And toilet paper. That's hilarious. Oh man, this is so good. And this obviously is the real one, but is oh, this is such a great way of creating an, a real toilet building at the entrance? A souvenir shop. Oh, look how good this is looking. That's amazing. And this wasn't even built with the tiny pieces. Maybe there are a few. I see the umbrellas. But the fact that it's custom made is even more impressive. This is so good. Just look at this. Some cushions. <laughs> oh, wow. This is fantastic, Miguela. Definitely so inspiring. Amazing. This is actually not even from the souvenir shops. This is the um, umbrellas that you can... What? It's... Yes, this is insane. This is the umbrella, right? Yeah, I guess so. Oh my goodness. What a great looking gift shop. Okay, we still haven't even entered the zoo. Just look at this! A jungle cafe. This is so inspiring. I love what you did here with all the green plants and then like the monkey sign. Amazing! We're just getting better and better every zoo that we see. It's, uh, it's so fun. 
Just look at the little one. Really like these heavy metal fences right over here. A keeper door. Is that like, yes. Oh wow, look at this. That's amazing. Some tools here for the staff to use. This is so freaking awesome. That little one. And also the fencing right over here around the trees, like giving it some green, but making sure that the elephants are not able to ruin the plants and stuff around it. Wait, did you just add thing? Wait, what? This is also for elephants. I, I, I somewhere doubt it. Wait a second, that's a custom made feeder. I was first like, oh, that's from the giraffes. No, it's not. It's custom made. That's insane. Okay, let's go around here. Yeah, it's just, just run, 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 run. No, no, no. No. You should keep running. You're late. I bet you're late. Animals are hungry. Animals need food. So where is this going to? Oh, look. Oh, well, pretty. This is so beautiful. I love how you use the plaster around here. This looks so nice. Little pool. Well, it looks like a little pool, but obviously it's the little enrichment feeder. But from here, it's like light blue. But it's the feeder, definitely. This is so pretty. Some cool signs here for the elephants. The walls here look so good. Oh, look at this. Oh, I like this. Oh, this is super nice. A cool viewing with some shade for the guests. Also, to make sure that they're not getting wet because of the elephants. Oh, wow. This is so fantastic. I love this area. I love the walls and all the green and stuff. Really nice work. Okay, we have flamingos on this side. Little waterfall, also some privacy. Oh, I think a billboard is not working here. Well, that's all right. Look at this. Little backstage area for the flamingos. Really like what you did here with the... Uh, Wooden uh, beams or wooden planks to decorate the wall, to decorate the wall a little bit. And this, I like this gate as well for the staff. And these doors are so good. Your, your foliage and rock work is so on point. It works super well. What do we have here? Something small. Wait, what? Is that maybe like plans or something? Doesn't feel like being a habitat. No, I don't think so. Meerkat Desert House. I first want to just check because there is arrows, but there is a way here. Oh, to go to the outside meerkat habitat. Just look at this. It's so nicely decorated. Oh, there they are. There they are. You're going to use that. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> Aw. I love the fencing here as well, by the way. Also, this one with the bricks. Look. Oh, you're kidding. Classic roof trim to make a wall. That's insane. But it looks so freaking good. Like, really, really good. Beautiful work. Oh man, I really like this idea. Okay, so the meerkat. Oh wow, that is such a cool indoor area. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's fantastic. Look at all these little doorways. This is for the keeper, of course, and these small doorways. There's a, okay, I think we can see that one from the other side of the habitat. 
<gasps> oh, oh, yes, okay, sorry, I should not go in here, but I'm just so curious to see. Okay, Meerkat Desert House. Look at this, a little education area. Oh, that is so cool. Little museum. Meerkat Facts. Meerkat Desert House. They are great at communication. Oh, wow. I really am a huge fan of this indoor habitat for the meerkats. Oh my goodness, this is so cool. Like you can't, okay, no, you can't look into that. I want to see this backstage area. Just going through the wall here. Just look at this. Oh my gosh, this is this. These are the builds that I need so badly. Like for inspiration for my own backstage areas. <laughs> I learn so much from these zoo tours every time. This is so freaking good. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, I love it. Okay, what do we have? Like, nice planter here in the middle. What is this? Oh, this is also for the elephants. Wait, how big is that? Well, wait a second. Okay, I want to see this for just a bit. Okay, there is a gate. And this Indian elephant habitat is huge. And they can also close it off. Like, I've heard that... I'm not really sure if that is for all types of elephants. But, like, it's, it's pretty common to also split the male with the females at some point for a certain reason. I'm not really sure exactly how, why, but... Yeah, the, if there's any zookeeper watching right now and you know what I'm talking about and you can explain a little bit more, please do let us know because I um, it, <laughs> it's somewhere in the back of my mind and I'm not entirely sure. Oh, it's so beautiful and lush right over here. Gorgeous. Okay, where? Okay, so the uh, right side. Right side, follow the right side. I love it that this is a completely different area from the zoo. What is that? Is that the Red River Hog? Yes, it is. Look at this little... Wait, okay, wait. The little one. I want to see the piglets. They're so cute. Oh, oh. Look at it walk. It's so funny. Oh, yes. Go and roll into the mud. Well, it's not really mud, but dirt. I guess. Oh, they're so cute and fluffy. They look so freaking amazing, these guys. Oh man, the details here with their rocks and their roots. And all these rocks. Oh wow. It looks so freaking gorgeous. So I guess... Okay, they have an enrichment item, a forge box feeder here, and another feeder here, which I just so much love. Oh, okay, wait, this is staff. Well, we know that you are doing staff stuff. Staff stuff? Is that a word? Yes, staff stuff. <laughs> Look at this. Oh my gosh. Again, like so much inspiration here for your backstage areas. This is why I should go for smaller zoos and just really go into all the details backstage and, and like everything that the guests can see in the restaurants. This is such a great example of how I want my zoos to look. And when building smaller zoos, I feel like it's it's better achievable. Oh my goodness. Miguela, this is so cool. Yes, 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 yes. Oh my gosh. I just love it when they do that. Oh, we just missed it. Are you going to lay that? Yes, do it for me. Go, 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 go. Yes. Oh. I just love it when they do that. <laughs> it makes me so freaking happy. Are these little ones also good? I don't think I've ever seen a little one. Oh, no. I'm gonna. Oh, are you? Oh, I don't think I've ever seen an animation of, of these little piglets uh, rolling in the mud as well. Oh, okay, wait, yes, okay, we're now illegal inside of the habitats. <laughs> Let's just quickly go back here. Oh, 
This is a great looking habitat. I don't know what noise that was, but... This is fantastic. And it's big. It's huge. Oh, there's one swimming here. Oh, yes. Um, oh, it's making me so happy. So let's go around here. And let's see what else we can find. Tiger Forest. Ooh. Oh, nice viewing gallery. Lots of education. Great picture. Oh, these signs are amazing. It works so well for this uh, for these habitats. Is that poop? I I guess. Wait, is that poop? You know, it's just a rock, but it almost looks like a pile of poop. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was probably not the intention. There are a few more rocks here and there. But you look at the water area here. Oh, that beautiful waterfall. Where are the tigers, though? I want to see them. That little tiny sign. That is so well made. Oh, let's go in. Oh, they're all backstage. Oh, what a cool backstage area again. It looks so good. Store drags. Can we also walk through here? Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, man. I love this. So, can we go around here? Yes. Tiger Forest. Look at these fences right over here. Amazing. Oh, and it's glass and chain link. Oh, that's interesting. The combination looks amazing. That is really cool. Love the gates here at the front of the, the shelter building. What a really cool habitat. Now I wonder, well, I guess we should just walk here. Look at this backstage area. What? That looks so good. Okay, so that's a, that's a keeper hut. And what's behind this door then? This is another backstage area. What is this for? This is a habitat. Oh, this this is from the elephants. Oh my goodness, I want to see this as well. It's huge. It looks so freaking good. Really, I'm so impressed by this. And the guests can't even look into the 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 backstage area or the shelter area from here. What is what is that? Oh, okay. I'm not really sure what's happening there. This is so freaking good. There's a beard taper habitat. Look at this backstage area, you guys. This is so cool. They can prepare food right over here. I really like this idea. Having a duel like this and then have the keeper gate right over here because obviously all the keepers cannot throw in the animals. Oh gosh, I love this so much. Um, okay, we have the elephants. We've been here, so I'm just going to follow this side. We have another view into the building from here. So the Malaysian taper, or sad beards taper, I think. Beautiful, lush habitat. Oh, the walls and tropical foliage are so good everywhere. Okay, we have an animal giant otter on the other side. Really like these walls here, these fences. What a gorgeous tropical habitat for the Malaysian tapir. Wow. Love the waterfall here in the back. Okay, now we have the otters. Is that the Asian otter? Oh, giant otter, sorry. Nice little tropical area here, but there is also something else. Can we go there? I guess so. Oh, we can go up here. The night. Oh, look at these fences again. Gosh, it looks so realistic. Oh, look at this. Oh, that's interesting. Very modern area. 
Oh, there are a lot of them swimming around here. I think we should go down. We can go down somewhere. Although I don't know. Oh, wait. We need to go around here. Uh, there are two. Okay, this this seems to be going down. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's so cool. It's very mod. Oh, <laughs> it's very modern, but looks really awesome. And they have so much space to deep dive and enjoy the and play in the water like that one is doing. Oh, this is so much fun to see these guys deep diving. Yeah, definitely really awesome. So what is it on the left side here? You, you can go there. Look at these cute statues. There are some facts. Backstage, of course. Like this. Okay, oh yeah, okay. That one is not really decorated, unfortunately. Oh, I was so much looking forward to it. Maybe you forgot or you were like, oh yeah, I'm going to finish that later on. And then, yeah, you were like, oh, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, I did see it. Okay, let's see. What else can we find if we go and follow the path right over here? I guess that it's not a super big zoo, so I'm not entirely sure. Tropical Sloth Greenhouse. Oh, I love the detailing here. That looks so good. This, this color scheme. What can I... What is this? The Indonesian Temple Brig. Oh wow, that looks really nice. It's beautiful. I love the doors. Really nicely made. We have some education in here. A little seating area, vending machine. Oh. Oh, I see what you did here. So we're going to pretend that the sloth... Oh, wow, this is so original again. I just love it when someone uses the uh, walkthrough exhibits in an original way. And this one shows because these are two exhibits, two walkthrough exhibits. Very nicely decorated. Hi. And then, like, they can go from from this... Ex well, they, they cannot go for real, of course, but they... they sh eh, realistically, will be able to climb all the way to the other side. It's, uh, it's such a fantastic idea. Mikaela, it's so original. You keep surprising me. Oh, man. Okay, let's see the other side. But it can go up here, all the way to this side. It's a fantastic idea. Definitely. Oh, there's so many in here. Everywhere you look, there's a sloth. Ah! Amazing. And there's also a way for them to go here. Okay, this is a dead end. It's not going outside or anything. What a fun idea. Really love it. Okay, let's see if there is anything else on this side. I think so. Tiger Forest. Oh no, we actually came from that side. Oh, there is a given house. Thank goodness. I'm just enjoying myself so much. I don't want it to be over. Gibbon House. Look at this beautiful entrance. Oh, fantastic. Oh, yes. Oh, I like that you use this, this light from the conservation pack. Oh, that's so cool. What a smart idea. Also having this as a little swing. Hi, beauty. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> <laughs> the sounds that they make, it's so funny. 
Oh, they also have an outdoor area. The climbing frames are so good in here. Great job. And then we can go here and look on the outside. I love that you closed it off with chain link fences. There's one tree right over here going through, but still closed off. Oh, man, that's such a cool idea. I've never seen anyone use that before. It works super well. Amazing. Really like this. Ah, oh, it's so inspiring. Can we go around here or is this a dead end? Oh, it looks like we can walk around here. Very nice work. And then, oh, what's this? Just look at that little awning here. Also closed off. What do we have? Oh, it's a fossa. Oh, that's so cool. This is really nice. Like these, these log combinations for climbing frames. Hi. Also, the noises these guys make. It's so adorable. I've never seen an animal like this in real life. They are so cute. They did such a great job on all these, these tropical habitats, indoor and outdoor. The, the designs, everything looks so good. Oh, hell yes, we are going here. I'm gonna keep hoping that the rest is maybe still decorated. Oh, it is, yes. Look at this. That is so cool because this, this one has another level to go up here. This is where the keeper well, in real life would enter. And then right over here is the entrance. It's a little bit lower. Ah, uh, yeah, I see what you did here. You tried to hide these ugh, ugly boundaries. Ugh, it's so frustrating that they are there. But this is the best solution, I guess. So, uh, yeah, you did a great job in incorporating that gate right over here and still have this, this multi-level backstage area. It's so impressive, so creative. <laughs> Amazing stuff here, Miguela. Oh, please let there be just one more habitat or maybe two. No, I think we already... Passed by here. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Okay, let me just double check to be sure. Ah, oh, this unfortunately was indeed already the end of this beautiful jungle empire zoo made by Mikaela. We already did see that it wasn't such a big zoo, but man, just really didn't want it to end. Mikaela, make sure the next one has more animals in there. You have such a great eye to detail, like your indoor, outdoor, backstage areas. They all look so on point and so nicely detailed and decorated. And like the, the gift shop at the entrance, in the restaurant or the cafe I should say it all looks just so amazing I always so much enjoy touring any of your zoos so thank you so much again for sharing this zoo as well with us for showcase on the channel absolutely loved it everyone out there please leave something nice for Miguela in the comments down below and let them know what you guys all think of this gorgeous mini jungle empire zoo leave a like at the video if you guys enjoyed it and subscribe Subscribe, of course, if you haven't already. And yeah, I just really do hope to see you guys all in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye, guys!